Anyway, so www.moviewienerorwinner.com said that Helium Buffoon was a bad movie. Yeah. And Helium Buffoon was a great movie. You love those stupid movies. I do, but this one wasn't stupid. You know, Brendan, you don't have to say www anymore. What? Why? You can just say the website name without the www. No, 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 no. That's how you type it in, Melissa. www. I know. That's how you type it, but you don't have to say it. If you said to me, moviewienerorwinner.com, I would know what you meant without the www. So no w. Effort. Okay, Brendan, for the sake of this conversation, what? you don't have to say www because I know what it is, okay? And so does the rest of the world. But anyway, like I was saying, I'm thinking of writing my own review and sending it in because I was not happy with the, what they wrote. I think you should. Well, I know. I mean, I'm saying I'm definitely thinking maybe possibly doing it. It's a good idea. Well, I said that maybe I might, you know? You won't. Excuse me. Are we doing all right here or what? Yeah, we're fine. How you doing? You guys chatting it up? Uh-huh. Yeah. Having a nice chit-chat? Hmm? Pretty nice. It's fine. Not our best. Yeah, a little back and forth. Mm -hmm. A little yeah. tete-a-tete. What? A little dialogue. Yeah? Yeah. What are you guys talking about? Soccer? No. No. Because there's a game going on. Oh, right. I was wondering whether you'd like to participate in the game. Um. Is our soccer game bothering your conversation? Oh, no. No, no, no. Should we stop no, no, the it's... soccer game and gather around? No, fine, no, no, no. Maybe we should fine. light a campfire so you guys can tell your stories. No, this is good. Spin your tails. No. Regale us, Brendan and Melissa. Coach, have a seat. Relax. Yeah. Well, Come hang out with us. Why do you bother getting stressed out yeah, about it? It's a pretty quiet game. Yeah, we kind of forgot we were playing, actually. Hey, what do you think this after-school assembly thing is all about? I don't know. I hate after-school assemblies. The rumor I heard is that Principal Plum was fired. And Mr. Lynch is going to be the new interim principal. <laughs> Mr. Lynch? What? Mr. Mm -hmm. Lynch? What? Yeah. Lynch? Lynch is about as qualified to run a school as a soda can. And I can say that because I'm his best friend. I didn't know you and Lynch were best friends, Coach. Well, we're not. I'm his best friend, but he's not mine. Who's your best friend? Right now, it's a tie between this guy I write to on the web. He's from Sri Lanka. He's nice. And this guy who hangs out at the bar I go to, who's going to supposedly get me a free battery for my car. But man, Lynch, I'm sorry, but there's no way in hell Lynch is going to be your new principal. It is a principal. I, yeah. Uh, well, yes. Um, <laughs> that's what I was going to say. You didn't let me finish. Uh, as interim principal, <laughs> I have... Interim uh, principal. Look, I said interim principal. <laughs> What's your problem? I don't know. Why are you mad at us? Yeah. Why don't you just do your speech? Yeah, you're the principals. <clears throat> as interim principal, I intend to... Stern... Fair isn't soft, even though my hands are cut. Anyway, I, I can t uh, uh. All right, Lynch, my buddy. Interim! I heard that, bastards. Okay, let's see what we got. <clears throat> Dear www.moviewienerorwinner.com. So, in conclusion, yes, yes, I know it's a funny way to start a review, but as far as I'm concerned, concerned, concerned. As far as I'm concerned, there's no argument. Helium Buffoon is a funny, smart, clever, hilarious, feel-good, high-energy tearjerker that takes us on a crazy edge-of-your-seat ride through the world of balloon delivery guys and turns it into a crazy world of buffoon delivery guys when Jeb suddenly has to take over the business. Yeah. Hey, John, you're taking up two spaces. Yeah, so what? I don't want my car scratched. Um, hello, you can't do that. Why don't you tell it to the principal, Four Eyes? <gasps> <laughs> oh, boy, I didn't expect to use up the first 25 minutes of class answering one question, but it was a, a very good question, Brendan. Uh, thanks. I have, I have another question, too. <clears throat> hey, Fink. Hey, class. What's up? What do you teach, Fink? I teach... Science, right? Yes. I gotta borrow your Bunsen burner. I wanna burn some stuff in my office. Hey, not that one. Hey, kids. No practice today. But coach, we have a game. So, no game today. How come? Because I gotta pick up a brand new free battery from my best friend who works at the automotive shop. <laughs> oh. Uh. <laughs> Woo! Uh. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Uh, <laughs> I told. Oh, sh
McGurk, I can't have you wreaking havoc in my name like this. Lynch, what are you gonna do, huh? Punish me? Make me stand in the corner? Hmm? You gonna call my daddy? You're making me look bad, McGurk. What else you gonna do, huh? Lynch, you gonna spank me? You wanna spank me? Spank me. McGurk. Here. Oh. There it is. Spank it. Oh, stop. Come on, spank. Stop. Oh, McGurk, come on. Relax, buddy. I'm just having a little fun. Uh, you know, you gotta lighten up, Lynch. Uh. All right, you're the man now. This could be fun. Just gotta take advantage of Please it. Please leave. I have principal things that I Let's need to attend to. Let's go do something. Let's rob the safe here. Uh. Do they have a safe? M McGurk. We'll take the money and we'll go out. We'll have a good time. What? Money equals fun. We take the money and then we go have fun. McGurk, how old are you? Oh, I know what we can do. This is fun. We're not going to do anything. We can steal the fire extinguishers. Oh, sure, yeah. Take all the fire extinguishers out. And where are you going to put them? Bring them to my house. As? And spray them at each other. That is a prank that could cause the school to burn. <laughs> 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 oh, my God. Please get out of my office. How can you not have an opinion on anything? I don't know. What do you think of my new earring? Um, I don't know. Well, then what do you think of my new hat? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You have to have an opinion. No. No, I can't. Nobody cares what I think. Well, that may be true, but you should still have an opinion. You want my opinion? Yes. This sucks. See? Wait, that's not in the script. I'm talking about the script, Melissa. It sucks. You're right. Brendan, you have to fix this. Yeah, it's stupid. Yeah, but hold on in a minute, guys. What are you doing? It's spell check. For the script? Now I'm working on something, guys. Well, Brendan, we kind of want to finish this scene. We'd like the... a little direction, you know, from the director. Just do, it, do it faster. Do it faster than you were I'm doing. I'm sorry, are we interrupting you by making our little movie? What? Okay, what? You just totally broke my concentration. What are you working on? Uh, nothing. I'm just writing a review. <sighs> What do you mean a review? Like, www.moviewienerwinner.com likes my stuff a lot, so they asked me to write some stuff. You're writing a review for www.moviewienerwinner.com? You guys, you I'm... don't have to say www. But yet... I don't want to have this conversation again. What are you talking about, Melissa? Yeah, you have to can... say it, Melissa. You got to say it. You don't, it. You because say everyone it. knows what it means. How do you know it's a website? Because you say .com. Yeah, but how do you know, how do you know it's, know it's just... www. Yeah, how do you know it's... that's a good point? Because it's just one of those things that when something's around for a long enough time in society, you can just abbreviate. Like what else? Like what? Like what names? For like, names yeah, of that's people. what I was saying. All right, you know what? Say www. I don't care. No, oh, you know what I'm saying. No, forget it. You're right. In fact, don't say www. Say World Wide Web every time you say a website. No. That's a total waste. That's a waste that's... of time. <sighs> Lynch, who is going to stop us? You run the ship. You're the captain. Lynch. Let go of that. How long I've waited to have someone on the inside at this school? Long time. But Kirk, this is not a prison. You're going to get us both fired. <sighs> Let me sit in the chair. Get up. What? Get no, up. No, you can't sit in the chair. I want to sit okay. in that chair. If I let you sit in the chair, will you leave? Maybe. Oh, it's a great chair. It's a great... I love this chair. I have to tell you that. I'm going to pee in your office. Wait, where are you going? Get over tell here. Tell me you never wanted to do this. That's not a real... That's the only plant I have... Shh, shh, shh. Oh, I've never had a plant in my office. Lynch, please, shut up. You're writing for www.moviewinnerwinner.com? Yeah. You're going to pay me $75, guys. Are you serious? Uh-huh. Let me see that. So, in conclusion... That's how you start your review? Yeah, because I have the final say. <laughs> it's catchy, I know. That's kind of annoying, Brenda. And then I sign it, Movie Guy. Oh, that's catchy. But annoying. Is Movie Guy your pseudonym? No, no, no. No, it's just a name that I'm using instead of my real name. The suspense was suspenseful, and the comedy was funny. But Movie Guy says, read the book instead. The phone book, that is, because it has less characters than this movie. I mean, what is it with these English movies? Alone at the top is the story of a love triangle among a circle of friends. Two best friends torn apart by success and failure and jealousy and success. Movie guy says it's a winner, but leave before the ending because it was too scary. I've never met anyone who didn't have an opinion. There's nothing in my psychology books about it. There's nothing I can do. Doc, please don't say that. Of course, I could call my friend Dr. Schwittenmauser. He could help you. Well, call him, Doc, please. I am desperate. I wasn't trying to insult you, Doctor. I'm just saying that with a name like Schwittenmauser, I didn't... You didn't think I'd be Irish, did ya? No. So, would you be having an opinion about to be new? Um, no. Then you're an idiot, sir. Um, are you a leprechaun? Let me tell you about laddie. An opinion is a thing to be treasured, but it's good to come out a here to mean anything at all. Was he pointing to his butt? Shh. And cut. Big cut. Oh, jeez. Guys. Guys. Hey, that scene, that was 
uninspired. And, you know, though the story held together, you know, I, I've ever seen better acting on a postage stamp, i got to be honest. Brendan. Hi, Dad. Yeah. You're being a jerk. Yeah. I'm just offering my opinion, that's all. You sound like one of your stupid reviews. Okay, okay. I also don't get the analogy. Let's just take a oh, look Brendan, at Oh, wait, do you want an opinion on the script? Because that is uninspired. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen better scripts on a postage stamp. Yeah. That makes more sense. Maybe if you spent a little more time on your scripts and a little less time on your reviews. Okay, you know, whoa, come on. Let's just take it from Jason's line again. And action. Brendan, can you come here, please? What do you want? Right now. Did you find my checks? What? What? What did you just Not say? What? What did you ah! just say? What? Nothing. Brendan, get up here and explain yourself. All right. So I thought you'd be mad because I'm just a kid. Well, I, I wish you'd told me, but no, Brendan. I think it's great that you're getting paid for writing reviews. I'm very proud of you. Well, then you're going to love this. They sent me press passes to see the premiere of All That Violence this Friday night downtown. Brendan, that's an R-rated movie. You better believe it. Called All That Violence? That could be violent. Well, see, that's the ironic thing. It's not that violent. Well, I don't want you knowing about irony. How about nudity? I read about that movie. It sounds absolutely inappropriate for children. Yeah, but Mom... You're not going, Brendan. I don't want to go. Trust me. But well, I've, that's perfect, but then, because... I've got a job. Brendan, you're not going. You're not going to a movie named All That Violence. But Jason and Melissa can go. I don't care what Jason and Melissa can do. But their parents probably don't know that it's called All That Violence. Until I call and tell them. Don't, Mom. Don't. Brendan, ever since you started writing reviews, you've been ignoring your work. Yeah, Brendan, and your friends, us. That's, I mean... Pretty much your only two friends. D guys, guys. Let me say it in a way that you can understand, Brendan. Yes. www.you'vebeenignoringus.com. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, www.i'msorry.com. But guys, I'm still taking you to the premiere. I thought you couldn't go. Yeah, and how are we going to get there? Your mom was supposed to drive uh, us. No, 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 no. I have an idea. Brendan, are you going to disobey your mother? Are we going to steal a car? Coach. Coach, I have a proposition to offer you. <clears throat> Coach. Brendan, get out of my light. Listen. Did you say proposition? Yeah. All right, I'm all ears. Can you pick me and Melissa and Jason up on Friday? That's actually kind of gross, huh? I'm all ears. What? What if I were all ears? Yeah. You know? Yeah. And can you drive us to the movie premiere? Ears instead of arms, ears instead of legs, yeah. just like a lump of ears. Coach, are you Of course, you I'm drunk right now, so that kind of stuff amuses me. Coach, will you listen to me, please? Are you listening? Of course, I'm listening, Brendan. I said I was all ears. So you want to ride somewhere? Yeah. Where? Movie premiere. All right. What's in it for me? Oh, it's tempting. All right, I'll do it. What the hell? Okay. I'll get back in my light. I'm burning up. Hey, interim. Fink's here. Again. What is it, Fink? Lidge. <laughs> what? You gotta do something about McGurk. Oh. He burst into my science class and started teaching again. Whoa. Okay, quick science lesson, all right? Don't mix beer with scotch. Why did that get no reaction? Everybody knows what beer is, right? Yeah. Everybody knows what scotch is. Yeah. Don't mix them. Liquor before beer, never fear. Beer before liquor, throw up quicker. All right? Fink, Fink, everything will be fine. I'll take care of McGurk. Let's come on! Help! Wait, wait, wait. I want you to hear something first. What about a Boilermaker? Those are good. Isn't that beer and scotch? Yeah. But it's not one before the other, it's together, in one, that's okay. Is there a rhyme for that? Yes. Attention, attention please. Uh, will Mr. McGurk please come to the principal's office immediately? Thank you. <laughs> so what do you think, do I sound like a principal? Yeah, I don't think you have to put your hand over your mouth like that. Really? I think this, this, this is the way it's supposed to sound, isn't it? Yeah, I think it sounds that way because of the intercom speaker. Oh. Th is that still odd? Oh, crap! Okay, so, we meet at the soccer field tonight. Right, and I'm gonna say I'm staying at your house, and what are you telling your mom? I'm saying that I'm gonna stay at Jason's house. Uh, right? you can't stay at my house, Brendan, because my aunt and uncle are there. Right, but I'm not, I'm not really staying, though. You can pretend to stay at my house, Brendan. Thank you. Where are you staying? I'm staying at my house with my aunt and uncle and my parents. No, but where are you gonna say you are when we're at the movie? Yeah, when we're at the movie. Then I'll be at the movies. Jason, you... What? Nothing. McGurk, why are you doing this? Look what I got you. McGurk, this way you don't have to walk we. 
don't have to walk all the way to the lunchroom to get a soda. You get one right here in your office. But Kirk, that is for the kids. I also to rigged use. it so they're free. They just come out. Press. Wow. Soda. Well, that is pretty good, I must free say. Free soda. That's, that's pretty amazing. But uh, you know who loses in this? I don't know who. The kids. I, I'm not. So what? They have soda at home. This belongs in their lunchroom, okay? <sighs> well, I'm not bringing it back. It's too heavy. McGurk, I don't need a soda machine in my office. I don't drink soda. Lynch. Please this move This is the like... Shh, Lynch. This is like a clubhouse. <sighs> Just you and me. Our own private club. No girls allowed. A soda machine. It's great. McGurk, if you don't stop this childish behavior, I'm going to have to do something drastic. Oh, so this is the thanks I get? Wh why would I be thanking you? You're causing... For being your friend, Lynch. Oh, well, then... Yes, this is the thanks you get. What are you talking about? Well, we're friends, right? Uh, uh, and friends steal things for their friends. But, Gurk, you can't keep doing things like this. Whether why? you think it's for why? friendship or what, you why, can't Lynch? keep doing it. Tell me why. It's bad. It's a bad thing. Who says? Me. I'm the principal. <sighs> I am the principal. It, it, people, you, you have to stop. Turn around. What? Turn around. You're being very childish. Turn around. For what? Because I want to show you something. All right. Now what? Lynch. What are you wearing under there? What? What are you wearing under there, Lynch? You do not need what to What are you that. wearing Girl. under there? Underwear? Underwear! <laughs> oh! Ah! <laughs> the story was just too hard to follow. I've said this about foreign films before. If you're going to go through all the trouble to make a movie, you may as well make it in English. Hello, Brendan. Oh, Mr. Lynch. I mean, uh, Mr. Principal. I mean, uh, Mr. Interim Lynch. Enough, Brendan. I mean, uh, Mr. Principal Thank you, Lynch. Brendan, enough. Uh... How come you're not uh, hanging out with your friends? Uh, well, I've got some work to do. I'm writing reviews for an online movie website, www.moviewienerorwinner.com. You know, you don't have to say www anymore. I like saying anymore. it. Whoa, oh. be careful. <laughs> uh. Is, there, is there something you, uh, you know, you want? No, I just needed to think. You know, I used to do my best thinking on the monkey bars, as I remember. Suspending yourself from these bars isn't that hard, you know. <laughs> hey. Hey. Suspending someone else, especially a friend, that's tough. Am I being suspended? No, no, no. Not you, Brendan. No, it's a it's a faculty member. All right. Well, uh, I'll see you. See ya. Nice talking to you. Uh -huh. oh. Oh. Ah. oh. Oh, crap. I don't like this, Brendan. Me neither, Brendan. It's fine, it's fine, guys. Don't worry Coach about McGurk it. Coach McGurk is late. He'll be here. Oh, I heard a long time ago that they found a head. Jason, I don't want to hear that kind of stuff, okay? Melissa, I was just going to say that they found a headlight. Oh. Next to a body. Jason! A dead body. Stop it! Go ahead, then. Make jokes. But did you know that the teenagers come here to get drunk on Friday nights? How do you know, Melissa? My father buys for them. That's illegal. Well, he says they're just going to buy it in a couple years anyway. It makes sense when he says it. Oh, now I know where to go. Brendan, there's nothing worse than drunken teenagers. Thanks to your dad. Yeah. We can't stay out here. We're going to be eaten by coyotes and elk. Elk? It's redding season. They're extra dangerous during the redding season. Yeah, and your father probably gives them alcohol. Guys, quiet. Shh. Oh, my God. Shh. Oh, my God. Somebody's coming to kill us. Oh, no. Let's set a car full of elk. Jason! Who's there? Drunken teenagers? I wish. Who doesn't love them? But come on, don't just stand there. Get in. It's rutting season. This is exciting. We're going to a premiere. A world premiere. Coach, is something wrong? Coach, talk to me. Uh, the battery's dead. I thought your friend was getting you a new one. Oh, uh, Kevin, some friend. He wanted me to pay for it. I want to go home. I don't. Coach, coach, you're missing the big picture here. I have to get to that movie. All right, there's a convenience store about 10 minutes down the road. I'll go, call for a tow truck, be here in 15 minutes. 15 minutes? You guys wait here. You're gonna leave a bunch of kids alone? In the car? Yeah. Not the first time. Ooh, movie starting. I'll be fired from writing reviews. Now, Brendan, there's a midnight showing. Jason, I wouldn't be able to stay awake. Hey, right, Brendan, what if I tickled you? Elk! Oh, jeez. Just Martha. me. Open up. Jump is 50 bucks. Uh... Buddy. Right, right. I got it. I got it. So what's your name? Tina. Tina. Nice. Wait, you're not tow truck Tina, are you? That's what it says on my uniform. I read about you. I have your calendar. You're amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fifty bucks. Here's a hundred. Wow. Tow truck Tina. Can't even believe it. You sign this for me? Sure. You got a pen? Brendan. Yeah. Get in the glove. Get me a pen right away.
You're all set. Wow, I cannot believe it. You can't imagine how many times I've, you know. I mean, you know, right? Yeah, yeah. People yeah. do that. Crank it! Yay! Yay! Did it start? Yeah. Yay. Thanks, Tina. You were great. And expensive. Can we just go home now? Hey, look. I'm sorry, Mr. Movie. If it'll make you feel better, you can blame me. I'm doing it right now, and it's not working. Hmm. That's too bad. But now, listen, I think we just all want to go home. Can't we just drive around a little more? I'm kind of up. No! No! Well, I hope you learned your lesson tonight, young man. I, uh, I sure did learn my lesson, Mom. If I do anything wrong, you will rub my head. Yes, I understand. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, I'm, what I'm, other I'm, lesson I'm, did you I'm. learn, Brendan? Don't, uh, don't do things. It'll come to me. Aw. That movie sucked. I liked it. You liked it? I liked all the violence. It surprised me. All right. Hey, McGurk, I was thinking, maybe there is something I can do for you. Oh, yeah? How about I suspend you for a week with pay? <laughs> now you're talking. Welcome to the dark side, Lynch. And in my opinion, Picasso was the worst painter I ever saw in my life. And in my opinion, Django and Cash was the best buddy cop picture ever. And this is fantastic, opinion, Dr. Schwittenmauser, but how did you cure him? Twas easy. I told him that everybody's opinion matters. I told him that too, but it didn't work. Yes, but then I told it to him a couple more times. That's why you make the big bucks. Speaking of bucks, do you like elk? This is the worst ending ever. Um, in my opinion, this is the worst movie ever, Brenda. Well, how do we end it? Just shut off the camera. That works. Uh, no, it didn't. Still on. Hey, who wants a wine cooler? Jason, where'd you get wine coolers? Your dad. Please be in here. Please be in here. Please be in here. Yes, yes, yes. Until a qualified principal can be found, Mr. Lunch will take over as interim principal. Mr. Lunch? I'm in principal monthly! Yes!